Hey everybody, welcome back to PBM's Video Entertainment and welcome back to another Thomas Friends DVD Reviews. And today we are going to be talking about Thomas and the Gen Engine and other Thomas adventures. So without further ado, let's jump into the history of Thomas and the Jet Engine. So Thomas and the Jet Engine was originally released back in July 20th of 2004 on VHS and DVD by Anchor Bay and Hit Entertainment. And of course we can never forget the Wind Train Bonus Pack release of Thomas and the Jet Engine. And then somewhere in 2009, it was re-released on DVD by Lionsgate. And Thomas and the Jet Engine could also be found in the Totally Thomas Volume 8 with Thomas Gets Tricked and Thomas Gets Bumped. And also Thomas and the Jet Engine could also be found in the Playdate Pack with On Sight with Thomas and Thomas and the Really Brave Engines. And Thomas and the Jet Engine could also be found in the Adventure on the Tracks DVD Pack. And now we got the history out of the way, let's jump into my copies of Thomas and the Jet Engine. All right, now jumping into my copies of Thomas and the Jet Engine. So I have the 2004 Anchor Bay release. So it has the green border or outlining, whatever you want to call it. Here, Thomas Burns logo, Thomas and Jet Engine, other adventures, which of course makes sense because there's other episodes in this release. And here's Thomas. He's surprised because he's going pretty fast because of that jet engine behind him. And then scene from Thomas and Jen Engine. Here's James looking all surprised there. And he's at Marin Station. And the DVD logo, yeah, it's not on the uh, the bottom right-hand corner. Cartoon Thomas. And here is the DVD logo. Anchor Bay. Thomas and Friends making tracks to great destinations. Scene from Salty Stormy Tale. And scene from... Percy and the Haunted Mine. Blurb. Run away. There we go. You can pause and read the blurb if you want to. Bonus material. And your story stops. Hit entertainment. Here's disc. Squish up version of the poster art. And we'll take a look at the booklet right now. And here's the DV logo right there. Here's this page. It just talks about what's on the DVD. And here's this page. As Thomas jetted around the island of Sodor, what did he see? And then here's a little questions about, about what's on this picture, basically. And here's a little, a little cheat spot or cheat codes, <laughs> or whatever you call them. Yeah, with Thomas Advertisement, and your, actually, uh, <laughs> these are the Thomas books that you can collect, and the activity stuff. And collect all your favorite Thomas videos on VHS or on DVD. And this one, I may have mentioned this in other videos, but, uh, Thomas and Jen Engine, yeah, it's in here. It's in a red DVD case. This was originally Thomas Soda Celebration. But yeah. Here's the Lionsgate re-release from 2009. Same exact front poster art. DV logo, I mean, I'm sorry. The New Style Hit logo. Cartoon Thomas. Lionsgate, the back, making tracks, Thomas and Friends making tracks to great destinations in the top left hand corner. And same scenes, same blurb, and same content and whatnot. Except this one's distributed by Lionsgate and it has the new style hit logo in the back. Do these exact same things, so it doesn't matter if you get the original or the reprint, you're always going to get this disc right here. Moving on to the multi-packs, here is the Playdate pack, which comes with, of course, it has Thomas and Jen Engine, comes with On Sight with Thomas and Thomas and the Really Brave Engines. Come along and join the fun. And there's Thomas and Percy and the Walmart sticker. I did not get this at Walmart. I got this at Half Price Books. And... Spine, Hit Entertainment, Lionsgate, 
Same thing on the spine and back. Small blurb about Thomas and Jet Engine DVD. DVD includes all this. And there's Thomas right here. The play date pack. Has a little advertisement of Rory the racing car. Nothing at the back. There we go. It's a little sponge, I guess, to protect the DVDs. And here's the disc. And here's the Canadian copy inside the Adventure on the Trucks import from Canada. Oh, dropped it. Thomas, Percy, and Harold on the artwork. And there's Thomas and, Jet en Thomas and the Jet Engine. Spine, new style hit entertainment logo. Distributed by Alliance. The back, small blurb about Thomas and the Jet Engine. Rated G in Canada. And here's the disc. And now let's jump into the menu tour for Thomas and the Jet Engine. All right, now jumping into the menu tour for Thomas and the Jet Engine and other adventures. We have Play All Stories, Pick a Story, Sing Along Song, and Thomas's Gallery, and Fun Games. Let's go to Pick a Story, like we always do. And there's Sir Top and Hat and Harold on the TV menu. And there's Percy chopping out of the sheds. And our story stops are Thomas and the Jet Engine, Percy and the Haunted Mine, Scaredy Engines, which are narrated by Alec Baldwin. And for the episodes that are narrated by Michael Brandon, Harold and the Flying Horse, Bulgy Rides Again, and Salty Stormy Tail. Sing Along Song. And there's Salty. And why is Salty Chuffin's theme? That makes no sense. And the Sing Along Song is... Boo Boo Choo Choo. Thomas's Gallery. We have James chuffing out of the sheds. And for Thomas's Gallery, we have video and DVD, books, wooden, wooden railway, and day out with Thomas. And fun games, which Harold will fly us over to the fun games stuff. All right, so the fun games options are Memory Madness, Counting Corner, What Came First, Character Cube, and Web Fun. The Character Cube is basically like the Character Gallery. And back to the main menu. And now let's jump into my review and thoughts on Thomas and the Jet Engine. So overall, do I recommend Thomas and the Jet Engine? Well, kind of like with uh, New Friends for Thomas, it has like some episodes from season six and some from season seven. But this time, we got Alec Baldwin narrating season 6 episodes and Michael Brandon for the season 7 episodes. And one thing I gotta say, for the season 7 Michael Brandon episodes in this release, like they, they were still using the, uh, the music by Mike and Jr. So this was before uh, Hit Entertainment decided to be like, hey, let's add for the US dub of season 7 episodes with Michael Brandon, let's add the, the music from seasons 8 through 12. Yeah. That's kind of what they, when they went with that, when uh, Hooray for Thomas and uh, Percy Saves the Day and Thomas the Real Brave Engines, when they came, when they came out, like they used the uh, they used the uh, the music from seasons eight through twelve, the hit era, and feels like they could have just kept the uh, the music by Mike and Junior, just like how they did with in the uh, on this release. So do I recommend this? Well, if you love Alec Baldwin and Michael Brandon, go ahead and pick this up. But if you if you prefer um, just Alec Baldwin or or the other, then you don't have to get this. But or if you don't like any of those, then I guess just get um, then just get uh, New Friends for Thomas. It's probably better for y'all. <laughs> so that's gonna do it for me, everybody. And the next episode will be on. It's great to be an engine. So stay tuned. See y'all next time, everybody. Bye.